Greenhouse Data is a 100% wind power data center facility that offers co-location and managed hosting services to clients around the country. We get our power from our local power company, Cheyenne Light Fuel and Power, of which they're able to provide about 20% of that energy through their local wind farm that's here just about eight miles west of town. We then buy renewable energy credits uh, from a company uh, down in Boulder, Colorado that will offset all of the additional wind energy needs that we have here at our data center facility. We also have invested in uh, the latest rack infrastructure, the most uh, energy efficient PDUs, the most energy efficient UPSs that, again, we're able to lower our costs that we're then able to pass along to our customers. At Happy Jack, we have 14 turbines, and at Silver Sage, we have 20 turbines. Between the two sites, they produce 72 megawatts of power. My name is Tom Bailey. I'm the site manager for Duke Energy's Happy Jack and Silver Sage Wind Farms, located about eight miles west of Cheyenne, Wyoming. Duke Energy was the successful bidder uh, for a request for proposals for green power for Cheyenne Light. And uh, so we built Happy Jack last year, and then we were the successful bidder for another RFP for Cheyenne Light and uh, Platte River Power on the Silver Sage project, which we constructed this year. Suzlon S88 wind turbines, which are on this site, produce 2.1 megawatts per turbine. Uh, they reach rated uh, power output at approximately 25 to 30 miles per hour of wind speed. And that will power uh, approximately 2,000 homes per turbine on average. On an annual basis, Happy Jack delivers approximately 100,000 megawatt hours of power, and Silver Sage would deliver approximately 150,000 megawatt hours. Today at 3 o'clock, we'll send out our nominations and say we're going to run 20 turbines at Silver Sage, 14 turbines at Happy Jack, and then based on the uh, wind forecast, we'll be able to predict approximately how much power we'll generate if we fall a little short or a little um, heavy then Black Hills and Platte River will adjust accordingly. Most of the maintenance is uh, prescribed predictive maintenance, like you change your oil on your car every 3,000 miles. We have 500 break, 500 hour break-in maintenance. So after the first 500 hours, we'll go in and do a bunch of maintenance. And then after that, it tends to be quarterly and it's lubrication checks, safety uh, checks, um, torquing of bolts, things like that. So we'll do it every quarter. These machines are designed to operate for 25 years. They're 80 meter towers, which is 262 feet. Uh, you throw in the nacelle and on the top of the nacelle, which is the part on the top, it's about 280 feet. The rotor diameter is 88 meters. Um, each blade is 145 feet long and weighs 18,000 pounds. Larger than the uh, wingspan of a 747. The rotors, when they're in production, are turning at 15 revolutions per minute, and that doesn't change. The higher the wind speed, uh, the more the blades will pitch in order to maintain that 15 revolutions per minute on the rotor. The actual tip of the blade, as it's traveling through that uh, arc, is uh, traveling at 159 miles an hour, however. These are Suzlon S88 turbines. Suzlon is an Indian company and uh, the components are manufactured both in the United States and in India and in Europe. Wind energy is a, a, a great source of renewable energy, uh, have abundant resources in the state of Wyoming. It's not the be-all end-all, but uh, wind is certainly, uh, I think, a good player in that balance.